Uh, Tucson is putting pet owners on notice. Keep your dogs on a leash and clean up after them or you could face a fine. 13 News reporter Catherine Patterson joins us live from Flowing Wells Park. Catherine, a lot of dogs out there right now? Yeah, I mean, Valerie, surprisingly, some people are out here beating the heat and walking with their dogs. But while they're walking, they're going to see this sign saying dogs must be on a leash at all times. And it's a requirement for a reason. For years, John Dorame has been a dog dad of three, but one day he almost lost one of them. My white dog, Dak, uh, was just walking. He was on his leash, and this dog just, I don't know where it comes out and gets him, rips his whole side. $6,000 later, Dak is still playing at the park. He would have been on a leash. I wouldn't have had to gone through that. That's for sure. And so are many unleashed dogs. So we've seen a rise of complaints this year um, from park users, from sport user groups, from neighborhood associations. Uh, having dogs off leash um, really does strike a lot of fear in folks, um, not only for the safety of their dogs, but for their children as well. The city of Tucson wants to help keep dogs safe with leash up cleanup, reminding dog owners to keep your dog on a leash and clean up their waste. Their poop is not necessarily the best thing for the environment. Poop in general can have E. coli, Seminola, so we encourage people to pick it up. According to PAC, it's a code violation to let your dog off a leash. I've seen dogs that are even trained that, you know, that still lose that temper and go after a dog. But they're working to educate, not citate. We want you to come to the park with your dog. We just want you and your dog to be safe as well as the other park users in the park. The city of Tucson also says that keeping your dog on a leash could help with any encounters with wildlife. Reporting live in Tucson, Katherine Patterson, 13 News.